we are pleased to announce our next workshop where you build your own 3D printer in one day. The 3D printer is a mature open source technology. It has gone viral based on the open source RepRap project with around 100,000 DIY 3D printer builds and a billion dollar consumer 3D printer industry which owes its existence almost entirely to RepRap. In this workshop, you will build a complete RepRap Prusa i3 with automatic bed leveling in one day to take home with you. Building a 3D printer can be a personal breakthrough, but in a greater picture, such learning has the potential for a cultural shift where people redis rediscover their own power of material production. Many groups ran 3D printer builds in the past, but we do not know of anybody who is currently offering one-day builds. Typically, it takes about a week for a nov novice to do a build and more time to get it fine-tuned. So if you don't think you have the skills or the time to build a 3D printer yourself, this workshop is especially for you. We guarantee that you will walk out with a working calibrated printer in one day because we'll walk you through the entire process. At Open Source Ecology, we typically build larger machines in our extreme manufacturing workshops. The 3D printer brings the extreme build experience to a much larger audience. The goal in the first workshop is to build a, a modest 12 3D printers, but can such a process scale to an entire auditorium of people to reinvent production in a community scale? OSE is interested in 3D printing because we want to produce several products of civilization, such as car body panels, such as local motors has demonstrated, 3D printed cordless drills, where if we build them, then they become a lifetime design product because we can fix them, or polycarbonate multi-wall glazing, made from recycled CDs, which could reduce the cost of our aquaponic greenhouse to near zero, or conical tanks for compost tea or biodiesel production, or rubber tracks and tires made from thermoplastic elastomers, which is 3D printable, which takes us back to our tractor work. We're also interested in metal 3D printing, as demonstrated by Michigan Tech's Open Sustainability Technology Lab, and ceramics printing like the WASP project for household goods or ceramic cookware. Housing is another huge application. A reprap based printer has recently produced the world's first commercial building just two months ago. Our goal on the technology front is to create a construction set for industrial grade 3D printers of many kinds. This is summarized in our roadmap for the 3D printer, which includes a recycling infrastructure where we make 3D printing filament while cleaning up the environment. The process around the technology development is to continue the design evolution while using a proven design in workshops. In this workshop, we'll be building upon the Prusa i3 printer, but our eventual goal is the industrial grade printer construction set. There's more to this than the technology itself. We also have a social enterprise goal to create a virally replicable enterprise for running 3D printer builds efficiently anywhere in the world. This workshop marks our first big step in the direction of distributive enterprise, which we wrote about first in 2012 in the MIT Innovations Journal. Our contribution to RepRap would be on the enterprise aspects, the extreme manufacturing workshop model of social production, open source supply chains, operations, marketing, production workflows, and other details so you don't have to reinvent the wheel yourself. Can open source product development like this take hold on a massive scale in general? Open Enterprise has the potential to provide the positive capital feedback loop for continued product development. If you are interested in running workshops like this yourself, either independently or with OSE, a good start is to participate and see what the process looks like. To continue the development process, we are running collaborative literacy webinars on Monday evenings, where you learn how we collaborate and design sprints on Friday afternoon where we work on the development points of the 3D printer roadmap. We see the potential of social production as a fundamental solution to any issue related to artificial scarcity. Did you know that today 85 of the richest people in the world own as much wealth as the 3.5 billion at the bottom of the pyramid? Social production can be a part of the solution. So build yourself and build your world.